Piers Morgan has issued an update on social media, revealing that Stormy Daniels will no longer be appearing on his talk TV show. Piers Morgan, 58, has been forced to announce his interview with former porn star Stormy Daniels, 44, will not be going ahead after the star, suddenly postponed. Taking to Twitter, the talk TV presenter told his 8.4 million followers. Update. Unfortunately, Stormy Daniels has had to suddenly postpone our interview tonight due to some security issues that have arisen. Hope she's okay. It comes just hours after the journalist announced he would be chatting to Daniels in what promised to be an explosive interview. He even claimed he had to postpone his trip, saying the interview was something the whole world would want to watch. Morgan had planned to interview Daniels in the wake of former President Donald Trump's indictment. Yesterday, a grand jury in Manhattan indicted Trump, but the specific accusations have not yet been made public. Only earlier today, Daniels took to Twitter to thank supporters for their kind words ahead of her interview with Morgan that was due to happen this evening. She wrote, Thank you to everyone for your support and love. I have so many messages coming in that I can't respond. Also don't want to spill my champagne, tongue out emoji, hashtag TeamStormy merch, autograph orders are pouring in, too. Daniels continued, Thank you for that as well but allow a few extra days for shipment. Following his indictment, Trump also released a furious statement calling the case against him, political persecution and election interference at the highest level in history. You remember it just like I do. Russia, 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 the Mueller hoax, Ukraine, Ukraine. Ukraine. Impeachment hoax 1. Impeachment hoax 2 the illegal and unconstitutional Mar-a-Lago raid. And now this, the statement read. The Democrats have lied, cheated and stolen in their obsession with trying to get Trump, but now they've done the unthinkable, indicting a completely innocent person in an act of blatant election interference. 